conserving water from the spring. Yes, it enables me to control the water in the drain sewers to some extent. Also, it can be used for all sorts of purposes. Like for drinking? Eh, well, that too. But mostly to run different machines. Ah, like water mills. Exactly. This is a water area. Okay. Surprising. Huh. Treasure box. Yeah. Good shit. A faint murmur echoes through the large empty chamber. Oh, I gotta fill it up. Oh, there's a valve over there. Knew it. Redirect sewer water. 7th of August, 1839. There is no denying that Alexander puts a lot of faith into what I can only describe as magic. I'm not surprised. Even while traveling across Europe, I assumed I would have to embrace the supernatural to save my mind and life. As a novice, I do everything in my power to stay focused and not dwell too much on my own doubts. Alexander woke me up early and told me it was time we got started on our work. He was obviously excited to get going, and we headed downstairs to the old dungeon, where he preferred to attempt his rituals. It turns out that Alexander is a true Renaissance man, paralleled only by da Vinci, I'm sure. He showed me several rooms fitted for specific research, such as anatomy studies, alchemy, and botany. The crown of Brennenberg must be the inner sanctum, a most hallowed ground where we shall attempt to permanently banish the orb's shadow. Well, we can only hope for the best. Well, this is great. Wires begin to slowly fill the chamber. Damn right. I don't like the noises I'm hearing. I really don't. Yeah, I'm gonna have to keep my lantern out or else my sanity is gonna start going down again. It's crystal clear right now, but that won't last long. All right, things are kind of lit here, so. It's attached to a rusty chain in the ceiling. Oh, um, I probably need something to throw them. Bridge must be lowered to proceed. A rusty chain, okay. Oh wait, I didn't read the rest of those notes. There are valves in the cistern to redirect water from the sewer. Right, right. Well, here's hoping I, my throws are good. First try!
So why was I allowed to go over there? What was the point of me going? <sighs> the rocks pushed me away, so... No, yeah, that makes sense. Redirect sewer water, okay. 8th August, 1839. I could never be certain until today that I was on the right path. Using my orb, Alexander managed to channel its power unto us. The inner sanctum flared with blue, fiery light, and I could feel the same things I felt in the dark chamber in Algeria. It was like standing in a mad whirlpool of impressions. It was terrifying, but Alexander kept calm and wielded strange tools of science in order to tame the storm. Suddenly, the blue light was stained by strains of red, and the walls burst with pulsating tissue resonating with the scene. Alexander quickly covered the orb in some cloth, and the unspeakable thing vanished. Apparently, the orb's shadow is closer than Alexander thought. He said I should prepare for a warding ritual tomorrow. I'm not sure what he expects, but I have a bad feeling about this. Seems to me like Alexander just wants the power of the orb and is trying to make Daniel out to be a scapegoat. That's just me. At least that's what I'm thinking. We're not going to talk about what just happened there. Because I'll be honest, I have no fucking clue what just happened. I think the geometry just gave up on me. I keep doing that. Nothing crazy is happening. Nothing crazy in the slightest. That's a strange sound. Well, that doesn't sound good. Okay. Stop that problem. I saw that gap there. 
now. 9th of August, 1839. It is still early, and Alexander is busy preparing for the ritual later today. Seeing him this worked up makes me question why. What does he stand to gain? I realize he is curious about it all, but surely there must be more. Is he so foolish he will attempt to tame the power of the orb? I must admit that yesterday, when Alexander flooded the inner sanctum with blue light, I realized we had but graced the orb's true potential. This might turn out to be more than escaping a creeping shadow. It might be the beginning of something truly extraordinary. That's what you think. Personally, I don't take stock in anything Alexander's trying to do, because I just do not trust that guy with the 50-foot pole. I knew it, it's coming. We're not. This whole level's got me paranoid. There's no freaking monster today. It is yummy. Paranoid for no reason. Oh fuck, did I just drown someone? Uh sorry. I'd stay for the record, I didn't mean to. Wander in the dark. We'll get to a source of light in a minute. There we go. The blue light blinded him, as it had done inside that murky tomb in Algeria. Just as enchanting as he tried to approach it, but the Baron's firm hand held him back. Yes, whatever you are, you're next. Always go left, right, or right, left, and then go to the middle. Hmm? Repair the machine powering the eastern bridge. Ah, uh, fuck me. Okay. Um. Alexander knew there must be a way to finish the ritual before it was too late. He had to teach his friend to harvest the Vitae. That much was certain. Yeah, this place looks nice. Ooh. should probably hold on to this. Leave right there in the middle. That way I know where it is. I didn't hear any of that. Alright, what's in this room? Another 
tight. There must be a loose portion somewhere down here. That's implying that there is a loose portion somewhere that I probably have to reconnect. I don't see it though. Alright, what's in the boss door? The clearly labeled boss door. gonna do if I do that. right. Well, this looks pleasant. Wooden crank? I'm not seeing any notes that'll tell me what I'm supposed to do here. At least I haven't come across any. Well, the only thing I can do is just kind of keep looking around. Thirteenth of January, seventeen ninety-nine. The work I put into this machine is unequaled by the reasoning of any man. The thought that generations of men have passed away since I first attempted to reconstruct the design is most tiring. It has the limitations of this world have made my work incredibly difficult. It has forced me to build the thing almost a hundred times larger than the delicate contraption it tries to emulate. Not to mention the flow of tamed lightning crudely replaced by pressure steam pushing its way through pipes and turbines. It shames me to think what the inventor would have thought of any my monster. Where he works the magnifying glass to carefully fix all the parts, I push five men to erect a tower wrought upon wrought iron in the hopes it will ev even the tiniest hint of the power. It will have even the tiniest hint of power found in a traveler's locket. I can't fucking English! Oh, wait a minute. What if that's a hint? Middle up, others down. Middle up, others down. in here? No? Oh. Okay. Alright, I gotta bring in those other pipe segments in here, don't I? Yeah, all right. Thankfully, I planned ahead. Baby grabby. There we go. 
I only ever found two, I believe. So I think there were only two. All right. Let's see what I can do with these. Oh, they're two different sizes, I just realized. Hmm. Okay. I'm assuming I gotta make it match. Okay, there's some implications that there's like two more that I gotta go find. Okay. I just gotta figure out where they're at. You know what, let's mess around with this one over here. Oh wait, I already did. Here we go, here's one. Well shit, I didn't see that coming. Huh. There's one more. All right, so it does look like I have to solve this one in here. I'm assuming I just have to get it all the way down. Okay. That takes it back up. There we go. Yeah! Never did find that other pipe. Alright, that last pipe's gotta be somewhere in here. Hmm. Uh, am I supposed to raise these? I'll be honest, I've got no idea. Oh. Oh, I see. I gotta get him matching again. Okay. All right. All right, so one slightly above the ground. The, the right one. further 
Yes! Hell yeah! None of your business. That's what. What's left is to get this last one in here, which means I gotta go find where that last pipe is. Not entirely sure where it is, but I'll find it. Potentially, it might be somewhere in this room if I had to guess. Maybe it's just a different combination that I gotta... Actually, hold on, let me try something. The purpose of the Inner Sanctum had always been to study the orbs and find a way to force them to yield their power. However, he was still unaware of this. Now... Yeah! The bridge is stuck and we'll need a push to dislodge. I had a stupid idea, like maybe if I get on top of that while it's raising. God, I hope this works. Oh, this is gonna suck though. This is gonna take this is this is gonna hurt me. This is gonna hurt. but ow yay yeah, it worked I'm not in a large oh great I'm going to the morgue I'm already like near death so I may as well just just tuck myself in he waited for his eyes to adjust to the darkness but no shape or contour appeared do you see Daniel it has yielded what the shadow as for now, come, let's get this out of here so we can get some peace. Yes, let's. Where to? Just down the corridor, to the morgue. Are there more dead men there? You did well, Daniel. Come, let's get going. 
This is probably where Daniel gets like abandoned or some shit like that. Yeah, I'm fine. I am definitely fine, not dying. Plague outbreak. The strange deaths among the servants and the prisoners have finally been resolved. It seems that the drain sewer, which has recently been opened up for use as a means of transport, is plagued by a peculiar poisonous fungi. The victims seem to have suffered an extremely quick outbreak of sickness affecting the entire body. Some of my men, including myself, are blissfully spared by this calamity, but it is clear that this cripples my progress. The prisoners die quickly, and their contaminated vitae lacks the energy I need. I shall immediately start working on a vaccine. Uh. The body is still stiff from rigor mortis and can't be older than day. You breathing, Daniel. Do you hear me? Have you changed your mind? I don't want to talk to you. I'm gonna... There's something missing. So I guess I am performing surgery, aren't I? Vaccine trials. The vaccine enabling my men to work in the fungi-ridden sewer is a definite success. Unfortunately, only a few of the servants have been remedied as the procedure proved difficult. The others will perish, and eventually I will have to create more of them to keep my experiments running. Note that an injection of vaccinated blood will work as a shield long enough to pass the sewers without any risk of infection. It will be- it will do fine for prisoner transport. Oh. So I gotta combine that needle with something. I fear for Daniel, for he is reckless. He is tainted by the approaching shadow and will not be able to pass the gate. Will he be able to accept this in the end? My love, I have seen evil in him. How am I to trust him with him, with the truth? What cruel irony that I have to do unto him what Agrippa did unto me. Ugh. Oh, thank you. Wait a minute. Oh, I've actually healed a little bit over time. That's positive, at least. Yeah, that's pleasant. Just, a. Uh... Oh. Yay! So much suffering and strife. Oh god, ew, ew, ew. Oh god, why? Why? Ah. Oh, that's not what I do. <laughs> Oh, my hand crank's gone, yay. That's... Oh, there's something missing. Ugh, fuck me. Well, I don't have any lantern oil, so... That body's gonna be drained blood like no other. It's just gonna keep on draining, I tell you what. What? What happened? What? 
visions in this one room what was that what did I pick up a copper tube oh a copper tube with an attached hollow needle <sighs> no lantern oil so I'm going in blind for a lot of this well minimal light Why did I suddenly slow down like that? Sorry, man. Oh! Did I just inject myself with that shit? Oh fuck, I did. I just injected- ooh. Okay, all right. I'm running on very low sanity right now. I just have to hope for the best. I hate... Oh my god, I hate this. 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 Stay in the light for a little bit. Clear up my sanity just a little bit.
Wait a minute. I got more light in the in that control room. to think that this is a lost cause. My sanity is so low, I'm not entirely sure I'm going to be able to survive what's going, what's going to happen next. No lantern oil makes this thing even worse. All right. Gotta do is go in there and hope for the best. No more oil is needed. I assure you, there's oil that's needed. Go, just go on a run. Just run. Oh, Graham. Henry Bedlow went to class carrying the anger of his bitter mother. He never cried. He made others cry instead. Pain is like that. You either become sad or you become angry. Henry always chose the latter. Ah, oh, thank God my sanity recovered at least a little bit. By a little bit, I mean none. Why? I'll definitely say for the record, I don't like being in a water area where there are critters that are out there now. Never mind. know if I went the right way. It just took the first path that I thought would take me the, whatever. Oh. What the? Little bit medium bigger, little bit medium big. Two levers control the noisy machine.
I'll be honest, I have no idea what I'm doing with this one. I guess I just gotta see until I get like the confirmation that I did something right. I'm assuming. Now it's a lot quieter. What's happening? What are you doing? Let me go! Please don't take me! Nobody ever returns! Sorry, pal, you done did got grabbed. Them's the brakes, kid. Wait a minute, who the fuck puts a tinderbox in a in a freaking pipe? The pipe seems to be loose. One pipe is loose and leaking water. Well, time to break it. Or not. What the fuck do I do with this? What? Pardon? Wanna run that by me again, Chief? It's not. I'm guessing my only option is to try to figure out what the puzzle is behind these gear things. The, the noisy one. Do I gotta make it noisy as fuck? That's about as noisy as it's gonna get. See if anything changed out here at the front. I gotta slow it down. Okay, so if I slow it down, I'll be able to find a way to get past it. Wait a minute. While it's doing this crazy speed, I should probably check out the pipe over here. Uh, the one that's broken. Maybe somebody changed about it. Well, that thing's having a fucking heart attack. Brought to yours by yours. Brought to you by yours truly. I can't fucking English apparently. Oh. I gotta jam it. I guess that's what I'm gonna do. All right. Ah. Oh, I love this. To jam the wheel, it must be slowed down. Got it.
That makes a lot of sense. I gotta say, I love this kind of game where they have like these sort of puzzles in them. I like them. All right, memory serves. It was. Perfect. Should be the right speed. Then, I'ma jam it. Possible to get through. One of the barrel gates appears to be weaker than the rest. Or the barred gates. One of the barrel gates! Hmm. Okay, so I need a tool to break through that. Alright, well, let's see what's in this room over here. No. Daniel, turn around this instant. You are carrying the shadow with you. I don't like that you're talking to me. Oh, oh, ooh. a good look at that thing. Ugh. Um I feel like I'm about to get jump scared. Barred gate was torn down by that creature. Turn around. Please. Okay. Yeah, I'm not freaking out. Not terrified or the slightest on those things.
enough. All right, new plan. That distracts it. Did it? <laughs> Fuck! No, 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 keep moving, keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Uh, 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 uh. Keep moving, keep climbing, keep climbing, keep climbing. Stop! Please stop. There was never any escape. Things like this live with you always. How could he know if Henry would show up down the road or even at his house? Is that mad? Would he do that? <laughs> 